The Mizzou Tiger basketball team announced the signing of junior college All-American Canu Post from Southwestern Illinois College. Today, Post is a 6'11", 260-pound setter. He verbally committed to Mizzou back in January. A native of Victoria, British Columbia, Post is expected to step right in and play at Mizzou. Former Rockbridge Bruin Travis Jorgensen made it official today, signing a letter of intent to play basketball at Georgia Tech next school year. Jorgensen left Columbia and played his senior season at prep school in New Hampshire. Jorgensen originally verbally committed to Mizzou, but he will end up at Georgia Tech. The Lincoln Blue Tiger football team is finishing up spring practices this week. Good numbers for head coach Mike Jones. 63 players. That's about twice as many as last spring. Coach Jones says his team needs to be more physical next fall in the MIAA. That's the idea this spring, although not too physical in the spring game this Saturday. Stay healthy, don't get hurt, and anybody get hurt. You know, that's the biggest thing. You know, the spring game is kind of a, it's, it's more of a showcase than it is the actual game. You know, you, you try and keep guys up, and you want, you know, everyone wants to be excited about a spring football game, but you don't want anybody to get hurt. That's the biggest thing. So you go out there and you try and execute as minimal amount of penalties as you can get, and then get out of there injury free. A noon start, Lincoln's spring game on Saturday is at Dwight Reed Stadium. And a big Lincoln football week event next week. The second annual Blue Tie Casino Night fun event put on by the Blue Tiger Quarterback Club. You can read about it on Leffler's link on our website, connectmidmissouri.com. Just about everything rained out in mid-Missouri tonight, but for the second straight evening, Helias Girls Soccer found a new home at the Blair Oaks High School football field. Elias, all kinds of chances in the first half. 16 shots. Becky Roberts did find the net for the lone goal. 1-0 at halftime. Second half, Kendall Smith makes it 2-0 on that goal. Then the rains came for a few minutes, brought out the umbrellas. And another Helias goal. Maddie Lammer scores 3-0 the final. Helias unbeaten at the Falcon Athletic Complex. 7-4 overall. And that is six wins in a row. High school golf in Camdenton. The Laker Invitational at Timberland wins. Rockbridge finishing fourth. Jeff City in 13th. Elias 20th out of 27 teams. It is Rod's Big Old Fish brought to you by Mid-America Bank. A bank that's good for you and your community too. A big old catfish taken at the Lake of the Ozarks. Sharon Shaw landed this 25 pound flathead. She needed husband Mike to help get that big cat in the boat. And look at this eight pound bass. Jim Wyatt made the catch in Millersburg. Jim didn't want to get in the picture, but the bass didn't seem to mind the attention on Rod's big old fish.